on its way to the opening set. This is the moment everyone had been waiting for. Tonight, the Olympic Games are in Madison, Alabama. I was choking back tears when I first heard the crowd and, and when I saw the people and all the lights and all the sounds, it, it blew me away. Thousands cheered on local speed skater and the city's final torchbearer, Liam McFarlane, as the Olympic spotlight was on Medicine Hat. Here, ladies and gentlemen, the Flamini Big Olympic Flame! I thought it was completely awesome and just really excited. I am so proud of Medicine Hat for coming out in such full force. We got the cadets here and a lot of, the, a lot of them, this is going to be the first time to, to get a chance to see the, the, uh, the torch or be a part of the Olympics, so it's a, it's a, it's a really big deal, I feel. Hatters of all ages poured onto the site to take advantage of the weather activities and find a spot for the big show. I'm here to see the torch for my first time and I'm going to come to support the Canadian athletes for their um, games in 2010. It's an opportunity for the city to come together, experience the Olympic torch, and to send a message to the world about what Medicine Hat's about and you know the tourism opportunities along with the TP here and you know bringing people in from all over. Including from all over the world. Canada, see you again, some incredible praznik. And I congratulate Canada for this great event. Medicine Hat is one of the few cities to welcome the torch on a Saturday. That's one of the reasons why the local organizing committee wants this to be a celebration to remember. To be able to do this and offer it as a, as a free event for the community and to have the Olympic flame in our city for two days and showcasing our, our, city, our city to the world is incredible. With more than 60 local performers, including headliner Medicine Hat's own Terry Clark taking the stage under the world's largest teepee, some in attendance say they hope it's not another 22 years before the city hosts a party like this again. Medicine Hat has been known for many years as a retirement city, but you can see the life, you can see the spirit here. Uh, this generation is not going to be forgotten in, in, in the whole concept. Also not going to be forgotten by many is being a part of Olympic history. I'm really happy they gave me this opportunity. Ina Sidhu, Chat News.